I'm pretending I like wine, but I just don't. Yes, you, actually, you like tequila. I've seen throw some tequila shots over there. Do you know what? I'm, I'm just trying to be cool. I'm Do you know who he look like? Who? Mr. Tom. He used to be a good person. Mr. Tomless? <laughs> yeah. You don't have horns. What are you he could do. <laughs> How pretty was it today? Amazing. Do we, do we thank our tour guide or I someone else? I think we thank Rosie for this. Thank you so much. Yeah. Thank you for coming, Pleasure. guys. No, An applause, <laughs> please. <laughs> no, you know why I picked Istanbul? I just thought it was a great city and it's very romantic. But it's, it's also cultural. very cultural, and it's not as cliched as Paris. An amazing idea. I'm really happy. Good. I'm not you really happy, happy but I'm, I'm okay. Happy. Wait, yeah. not really happy. No, I mean. Oh, maybe your the birthday's not lasted about four months. It's perfect. So far. Good. The guest list is shit. What's wrong? Tell me. But I'm not happy. No, I can sense that, but why? Come on, like, I'm your friend, mate. I'm your friend. Like, we're going on holiday. Everything is perfect. I'm going with my boyfriend, and you want to invite. My ex. His ex. Okay, can I explain why? That, why? Yeah, why? I, I need to explain why I invited Verity. In the Cotswolds, we all had such a fun time, and I know that you didn't have the best evening. No, but the next I day had... we had such a good time with Verity. I know, but I have a good time. I had a good time with her when when James, James was not here. here. And now that he is. Well, obviously it's okay, weird. Okay, okay, okay. Maybe, maybe. Do you have an issue with James and Verity's friendship? I have no, no problems it's just with Verity. It's situation. fine. I have a kind of respect for her. Yeah, it's very plus. I love her. She's very, very Which is why we get on so well because there is nothing to it. Okay. James, from your point of view, how do you feel? Guys, this isn't like a couple's therapy, right? I didn't now. say it was. I'm just asking no, how you feel about the situation. Not, I don't it's want not to couple's therapy, James. To Chill out. I don't think. You have anything to worry about, Mayfair. Given your history and given the fact that things haven't been the easiest in the past, yeah. I don't understand why you, James, have now been a little more flashy towards Verity. Mine and Verity's relationship, okay, it ended a long time ago, but please understand, I don't know why I'm explaining myself here or trying to justify myself, but we were in, we were in such a toxic environment and now we're out here and I feel like she can be my friend again. I wouldn't want you to be on your own. Do you know what I mean? Obviously, never be on my own. you obviously, you know, you still fancy James. I'm and, telling you, I'm, I'm joking. Don't. I am joking. And obviously, Mabel's with him, and like, you know, that's obviously hard for you. Cool. Thing is, I can see he is quite clearly flirting with you. And He's flirting with me for a while. And there's a, for how long? Like ages. Has he ever done anything that, like, oversteps the mark where you're like, OK, I know you're slightly flirting, but this is ridiculous? Yeah, maybe. Like what? What? Oh, I don't know. I just felt like I can't tell anyone. Oh. Verity, I'm going to be honest, we're almost best mates. It's probably nothing. Yeah, but I feel just bad that I haven't told Maven. It's probably nothing. OK, ready? Go. Right, so, we were at a party. It's the same night that he kissed another girl. And then James sort of lifted up the covers and got in bed with me and then cuddled me all night. Ah. I wanted All to... night. I mean, no, like, my instinct. cuddled me all night, like, pro like, hugged me. And I was a bit like, what are you doing? He's like, oh, no, we really like being here. <laughs> so not annoyed if I can Well, I just sort of, like, blocked it with my memory. Do you, know what, the, the, do you know what you should be doing? You should be going straight to Maeva and being like, Maeva, I'm going to be honest with you, whether you accept it or not, whether you like it or not, this happened. He goes, I'm sorry. No, I've had enough. Do you know what, Verity? In the morning, Verity, he goes, can you not tell anyone? And I went, but, no, but if you're going to fuck it, Verity, if you're going to tell someone to not tell someone, do you know what that means? Do you know why Jamie told Rosie to not tell anyone? Yeah? It's because he didn't want anyone to know. Why do you not want anyone to know? Because he fucked up. Oh, no, Why I does can't James do not, this. not want anyone to know? Because he fucked up. Honestly, I feel so bad and so guilty that I haven't told her this because we have developed a really good friendship.